Seesaw is a great tool for teachers to be able to use with students of all different grade levels and content areas. Um, I think it's a fantastic communication tool between the teacher, the student, and even including the parents. Uh, I'm showing you Seesaw has a great help center, so if you're like, what in the world, how would I ever start it? It is fantastic and easy to start. I have a class here, and I just wanted to show you one of the things that I was impressed. I recently had not been to Seesaw for a little while, and I came back, and I'm like, wow, they've added this activity library. So if you want for your students to do some activities that would utilize the iPads with directions already created, this is a tool that you want to use. Um, like right now, I'll go ahead and select, let's just say fifth grade. There are some pre-made activities that you can easily assign to students with written directions. There's a picture. They give you very specific directions. There's even, um, you can play somebody recorded with the recorded directions. And then you just simply assign this to your students. Um, I'll just scroll through here. There's a fall poem. You could do a describe yourself. I love this for science. You could recap a science experiment. Um, there's math directions, even writer's workshop. So once you want an activity uh, for your students to do, you just select choose and then you tap on share and it is going to be assigned to all your students in that class. Um, Basically, I feel like this is a great way for a teacher that's not sure. I've talked a lot about SAMR, um, moving from substitution, augmentation, up more up to modification or redefinition. And this is a tool that you can just simply put your students in, pick one of the pre-made activities, and right there you're already probably bringing it up to um, modification. So hopefully... This little take two for tech has encouraged you maybe to think of trying Seesaw, and I hope you have a great day.